Good evening, Cleveland. Woo! I'm just kidding. What's up, everybody? Woo! Hey, thanks for coming to our party tonight. And uh, feel free to show your tits. You know you want to. Wow. So we've been playing acoustically for about two days straight, so we're pretty, pretty good at it by now. We could fuck it up, but we're gonna do a, uh, we're gonna do a couple songs off our new one, and then we're gonna go back in time and play something from our record from 1981. So hey, I just want to say something real quick. Is it, is it your girlfriend right there? For real? That's your girlfriend? That's no. fucking crazy. <laughs> That's, that's your mind. I can't believe that you, you must either be fucking really rich or have a really big dick. That's all. <laughs> He's probably and rich. That's fucking awesome. Congratulations. It's fucking weird to see you guys together. But... <laughs> Is that really your girlfriend? Oh, oh my, my god, god, dude. Aww. Do you love her? Do you love her? You know what would be really cool at our album release party? If you were to ask her to marry you. <laughs> I mean, if you really love her, I mean... If you asked her to marry you and then we all fucked her pussy in front of you, that'd be fucking amazing. Anyways, we're gonna do a song of our new record. And uh, we, wanna, we wanna thank Jim for opening the show for us. He, we just did the interview down in the backstage and we just asked him if he'd come up and introduce us and he did, so thanks Jim, that was really cool. Thanks Jim. Awesome. And I'm sorry to put you in the spotlight right at the top, but your, your daughter it really is hot, so. <laughs> this song is called The Burden of Being Wonderful. This is on our brand new fucking record. All you can eat. Woo! Oh, reverb. noise for the guitar solo. I'm just a Maserati in a world of chaos. Genius would describe any of my ideas. If I was born in 1453, Leonardo da Vinci would be jealous of me. But a world of Stevie Wonders will never say It's a bird in being wonderful <laughs> 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 
like me point out that over 60% of all the lead vocals are live tonight. Uh, yeah! It's pretty fucking awesome. Hey, I got something to tell you, just to get honest with you really quick. The yeah. ending is not supposed to be that long. I fucked up the timing, but it worked out good. Because you guys fucking went, yeah! And now you look like a dick. What? <laughs> if we didn't say anything, Mike, they would have believed it. It was just bored bitching that way. Yeah, I think so. Hey, let me introduce the band just for people who don't know. On the bass guitar, one of the foxiest guys in heavy metal. Please put your hands together for Lexi Fox. Thank you, Thank you, By the way, I think you look fucking very, very good with the lights down like this. Thank you very much. I would fuck your face. Thank you. And on the drums, well, sometimes on the drums, but tonight on the shaker and background vocals. He also drives our tour bus on tour. Yes, Sticks in it. Thank you, the box. Thank you. And uh, the guy that's tuning his guitar is uh, one of the main guys in the band alongside me. Uh, well, as you know, like in every heavy metal band, there's two main guys. There's a lead singer and a lead guitar player. Make some noise for Satchel. There's, thank you. I'm Satchel, I'm lead guitar player. <laughs> lead guitar player is usually the guy who writes all the music and tells everybody else what to do, and that is certainly the case tonight. <laughs> and the singer is the guy who gets all the good pussy. Yes, he gets all the great fucking pussy, <laughs> if you consider very fat chicks great pussy. Yeah. I do. Hold on. So do I. Fat so girls I. suck the best dick. So. Uh, they do. They have to. They're fat. <laughs> well, a hot chick, like, I'm sorry, dude, but, you know, they don't really suck good dick because they don't have to. You know what I mean? Nope. Entitled is what she is. Okay? <laughs> Spoiled. I can see it on her face. Oh, you know what? Real cool. She's going to be backstage. That's really nice. Okay, uh, I came because my boyfriend wanted me to come see this little act of yours and your bitchin' new little record that you have. It's so condescending to women and sexist and gratuitous and all these big fucking words that I le learned at college. And I just want to tell you right fucking now, not everybody is here to suck your fucking dick. Not every girl in this fucking room is a fucking groupie, okay? Some girls have self-respect. And I'm backstage right fucking now to tell you, oh my God, I didn't realize you guys were going to be Get naked. This is kind of uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm all. <laughs> oh my god, these are. You guys use these mics every night, don't you? This is fucking hard. Guess, guess, guess who in the band spent some time in jail? Shut up. It's like belly button lints on this fucking thing. I don't know what, I think we should do another song before I fucking I get gangrene on my tongue. My balls itch. Yeah, yeah, I know they do. Don't ask me how. It's because the spring it happens. I got uh, you. Uh, yeah. So we're gonna do a uh, we're gonna do a song. Uh, this song was written uh, back in about uh, 1987 when we did our first van tour together. And uh, we pulled up to a little town and we met this chick that was in a Camaro and her name was Donna. Hey, Donna! Yeah. yeah! She had a big pussy. <laughs> Just kill her. It's like a steak. But anyways, uh, it turned out uh, we, <laughs> we realized we were in Oklahoma. And that's when this song came about. Check it out. We're gonna do, this is an oldie but a goodie. Yeah, Sing along if you know the words. <laughs> Nice move. Well, I bet you never guess when you came to the show. You'd be getting on the bus with me and doing some blow. Your mama's in the parking lot looking for you. She's gonna find you when I'm done. I'm all covered with goo. Ooh. Little girl, 
Hair on your nipples, zits on your box. In Oklahoma City, you're considered a fox. What you have to do for that backstage pass? Cause I found a poison laminate inside of your ass. So come on, pretty baby, suck my balls all night. The drama says we're leaving, come on in line. Spit out that retainer and do me right. Oh, come on, pretty baby, suck my balls all night. Oh, yeah. Some girls forget that shit. <laughs> Unless you go Chris Brown on their ass, you know? <laughs> what? It's true. <laughs> I wanna thank you for the love that you spread over me I'll be singing about you on the next CD And you won't have to wonder if you call BD You'll be screaming my name when you sit down to pee yeah. My balls all night I'm hopped up on Seattle's And you're high as a guy I know it tastes infected But I think it's alright Oh, come on pretty baby Suck my balls all night All around the world There's a hundred billion stupid girls Just like you Just begging for nuts to chew Oh yeah But I think it's alright Oh, come on, pretty baby Suck my balls all night So come on, pretty baby Suck my balls all night That was fucking awesome We sound great Oh my god, right in the middle of that too Your girlfriend pulled a Sharon Stone I saw her vagina That's fucking bad Foster right, just it was fucking bitching. I thought it was a couple of mud flaps dangling. Hey. I didn't know. This is really... I'm having a great time right now. I'm having a good time. This is such a great audience, and I'm not just saying that because I'm peeking on my ecstasy either. I really feel <laughs> comfortable. You know what we should do? We should uh, ask the lighting crew to maybe just light the audience up just a little bit so we can see everybody I back that's there. That's a great fucking idea. Hey, uh, Mr. Lighting Crew, Dell, can you Mr. light it up a little bit more? The lighting crew is one guy. <laughs> Let's ask the lighting crew guy slash sound man there owner. You are. A little more, Dell. Light him up over there. Just get a little there we light. Go. Ooh, that's uh, that's 